Bye. Bye bye. My favorite thing in the whole world is elevator selfies. Elevator selfies. We be getting so wealthy. We getting elevated in the elevator. You know what? Freestyle rapping is good because it makes you access a part of your unconscious brain that you usually don't get to. You have to call upon words all the time. This is good for coming up with ideas, aha moments. It's science. It's helping you come up with ways to transform your life that you usually wouldn't think of. Oh hi, what is up players? What is up? We've gotten a bit, we've gotten into a bit of a routine lately. Stop it. We've got, we've gotten into a bit of a routine lately and we're about to break out of this routine this weekend. Today we're gonna go uh, show you a new part of town and then tomorrow something very special is going down. We're gonna share with you later. Heading back up to the roof. Gonna go do getting lean course week three, day three. The reason why we're doing it today is because tomorrow we're going to do an ayahuasca ceremony and so Sunday we're probably gonna be pretty out of it. We'll talk to you more about that later, but first, time to pump it up. Today's workout, and we're about to get some deep. But first, but first, we want to talk about what we're going to do tomorrow. Ayahuasca. Well, actually, here in Colombia, in Peru, I believe it's called ayahuasca. We're gonna take something that's basically it is ayahuasca, but it's I don't know. It has a different name here. It's called jaje. Same effects. If you have not heard of ayahuasca or jaje before. A lot of like popular like TV shows are cover this now. Like Chelsea Handler went and did it. I think there's been like a bunch of Vice episodes. Yeah, Vice. Business it, inside. It's pretty. Yeah, it's pretty mainstream at this point. But we want to talk about like why we're going to do this. <sighs> Ran out of space. The old memory card there. Ha, old memory card running out of space happens every time. Classic. Uh, we're just about to say why we're going to do Jahe Ayahuasca. We're going to go do the ceremony. So. Dana, do you want to tell them like what your personal reason is for wanting to do this? Yes. So I don't. I haven't told many of you. I don't know. I've told no one. But when I came down to Colombia, I, I recently broke up with my girlfriend, and this is someone who I love very much and I care about very much, and it was a very difficult decision. But I know it's the right one, and so I really want to focus. The reason I'm the main intention I'm going into this with is to figure out as a man. What am I truly looking for in a relationship so that the next relationship I'm in with a woman is everything that I want it to be and it's, it, it's just the most incredible experience I could ever imagine having. Um, and I think that doesn't start with the woman, it starts with me. It starts with stuff that's going on inside of myself. As many of you know, I have social anxiety that I've dealt with my entire life and that's also a big part of um, of this. So I think in learning more about myself, that's going to help me in my relationship, whatever it is that I go into it next. What you doing? For me, well, the, mine's like two problems. So one thing is I'm super just like energy sensitive, just in general. I've done a lot of like energy training in the past and I don't know if that like made me hypersensitive or whatever, but I want to learn how to become more in control of my emotions, especially with the people that are closest to me in my life. And then beyond that, just working on patience because like the fact that I'm not very patient, I think helps the business sometimes like move forward, but other times it just detracts from my own happiness because I'm tweaking. I don't let myself rest. I don't let myself like chill. Um, I don't let myself just enjoy the present moment and like all the cool stuff that's going on here, especially with Zen Fitness. So I'm going to go take those things on and I guess we'll report back tomorrow. You guys see us uh, in the process. We are gonna go eat, break the fast. What time is it? Like one or two? Dude, dude, it's almost three. It's almost 3 p.m. So we're gonna go eat some food at this place called Marsano del Rio. It's like a big warehouse with different food options. You'll see us soon.
What are we gonna go do, Dan? We're gonna go break the fast. <laughs> Chicken in Peru, what's it gonna be, man? Peru. Where it is. It's Peru. Yeah. It's really close geographically, so I figured why not support a neighboring country as well? I can't do that, marijuana, because I'm doing ayahuasca or jahe tomorrow. Jahe. Jahe tomorrow. Jahe. Jahe. I'm doing Jahe tomorrow. And you can't eat red meat, you can't smoke weed, you can't drink alcohol, you can't have sex for like three or four days beforehand. But I am going to be straight chilling tonight. As you can probably saw on the vlog, Dan and I have been spending a lot of time together. Dan's going to go do his thing for the night. I'm going to hang out with this girl. And tomorrow we're going to do a little shopping. And then we're going to go get out of town. <laughs> we're going to get out of town and we're going to go do the Jahe experience. Jahe experience and we'll report back and you'll see the vlog and see how that goes. Good night Zen Dude Nation.